Hey ladies, how you doing? So yes, you see, I have taken out my twists. I have a video coming up on the reason why I took them out. And you'll be finding out if I'm going to put them back in. If I'm going to go get a sewing, all that beautiful stuff. So that video should be up. If not tomorrow, it will be up like Monday, Tuesday. But anywho, yeah, my hair is growing. My hair is dirty. What I did when I took the twists out. It was so moisturized. This QP stuff is amazing. That's why I want to do a twist out. I'm itching to see how my hair's going to turn out. So that's why I'm doing this. But I want to do it on dry hair. So um, my hair is dirty right now. It hasn't been washed in two weeks. So I'm definitely going to shampoo my hair today. And I'm going to just put some regular conditioner in my hair. And then I'm going to blow dry it with some heat protectant, of course. And then I'm going to come back and I'm going to twist my hair with this lovely mine is dirty now elasta qp this is the olive oil and mango butter and it smells amazing i hope this lighting is okay i'm in a different bathroom in my house because apparently nobody wants to like share a bathroom i have three bathrooms in my house two full and one half and it's you would think i had like an army full of men up in here but i don't but anywho yeah we're gonna wash this in. I'm eight months in February. I make a year for my second big chop. So I think I'm doing pretty good. My taper cut is gone. It's no more. So I'm pretty much TWA all the way. So I do have a shirt on. So I know you probably this is my my wash shirt when I wash my hair or something like that. I put this top on. So yeah, let me get to wash it. You know how I always do. I'll come back with everything already done, and we're gonna start twisting. Okay guys, so I got some regular conditioner in my hair, just some Pantene, I'm going to let it sit for about maybe 15-20 minutes, and then I'm going to come back with it rinsed out and blow dry. I just wanted to sit with it for a little while because prior to me putting the twist in my hair, my hair didn't get co-washed for like a week. So I wanted to, you know, just kind of wash and give it a good wash because what I was finding, oh I can't tell, I'm going to tell you that in the next video, I'm going to give you all the information on why I took them out, but yeah i'm gonna come back with it all out and we're gonna go for it okay ladies so i am back and i washed my hair conditioned it let it sit for like 20 minutes and then i washed it out and i blow dried it what i put in my hair i put in the ozzy hair insurance love this stuff and what i blow dried my hair is with the dr miracle this is their thermal heat protectant it's like a gel gel like somewhat formula and so my hair I section my hair in four four sections one two three four and then I blow dry it as you can see this is eight months so ladies be patient your hair will grow you guys know where I came from I had a nice length of hair I chopped it off a second time and now look where it is this is eight months and this I think this is darn good coming from a a real real low low almost Caesar type hairdo so I blow dried it and I'm liking it I'm really really liking it I'm happy I blow dried it I was kind of nervous about it but this stuff right here is like a dream you put it in the palm of your hand roll it up and then put it on your hair finger it a little bit you might want to take a wide tooth comb comb through it get the kinks out take the blow dryer and just go through it and is is out. This is probably the most I've ever blow dried my hair since I've been natural. Maybe twice. I'm not gonna lie for y'all. But yes, I'm I'm loving it. You can see how much hair I have now, and my hair is growing rather fast. So ladies, be patient. I'll be a year come February post second chop. I can't keep track, but this November I'll be two years natural. So I'm going to start twisting my hair. I want to do a different look. I, I want to. I want to go for. It's still tapered, but it's you know it, you still see the shape. Like I guess they call it the heart shape or whatever. You still see the shape of my hair, but it's not you know close. So what I want to do is I have my part here already. I didn't want a real defined part. I don't know if I want the flat twist it after I saw my after I saw how it came out blow dry. So maybe I should flat twist it. 
But um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just two strand twist all over. Kind of fairly small because I want to have a defined look. And I want it to kind of sort of still, it's, probably, it's going to be shrinking I'm sure when I take it out. But I want it to be really defined and kind of fluffy. So, um, yeah, let's see how we're going to start. I'm going to turn the camera a little bit. Okay. Because I want to stand this way so I can kind of see. And like I really want to flat twist this, but I'm scared. I would hate to flat twist it and then it doesn't come out right. Cause I don't I don't really have best of luck with flat twists. Maybe when my hair gets longer. But I will say blow drying, you're putting the heat on your hair and everything. But I do like the way I'm able to manage my hair while it's blow dried. I'm not sure if you ladies kind of, you know, feel that way. Some of like to do their hair while it's wet, but I kind of like this. I really do. Okay, I got the comb that I'm not supposed to be using, but I'm addicted. Okay. I'm going to get my... Buttercream. And everything that I used pretty much came from the drugstore. Well, it did come from the drugstore. This came from my beauty supply store. Um, my mom wanted uh, um, thermal heat protectant, so I got myself one too. So, other than that, I probably would have been using it. I'm not sure the name of it, but it's like a green one. I'm just talking crazy. Don't mind me. So, I'm just going to put a little bit on. I'm not going to saturate it. I'm not going to because... One, I don't want my hair to come out white. And two, I don't want the cream to weigh my hair down. And it is water, it's some water based. Like, let me see, where's water at? Hmm. kind of fall down but it's still kind of a wet substance and I don't want my hair to shrivel up so you see can you see that okay there it goes so what I didn't do I didn't put any oils in my hair this is just olive oil and and rapeseed oil I just used this jar I love olive oil and rapeseed oil you find it at your local grocery store supermarket wherever you're from I say supermarket I'm from, from New York but why am I looking over here? You see me looking over here? I would be looking right here. Okay. I'm from New York, so we say supermarket. I know here in the South they say grocery store. But the regular one, you know, Food Lion, if you're down here, Lowe's, all those nice stores, Kroger. So, if I'm looking to the side, don't mind me. I have a mirror behind there, so I can see really good. So I didn't put no oil in my hair, so I'm just going to put some in my hair now. I didn't want to put it in there while I was blow drying my hair, because sometimes when you put oils in your hair before you blow dry, it kind of weighs the hair down. So I'm just going to put some in the palm of my hand, just a little drop. And you might start seeing it all dripping through because you know how when you put oil in your hair. I done messed that twist up. I can't believe how my hair is growing. I'm going to take this twist out and twist it again because I kind of... Messed it up. See, I have oil dripping already. So, I'm just going to do one more twist, and then I'm going to come back with my hair all twist, because I don't want to keep you guys waiting. You know how I do. I like to just show you exactly what I do, so when it's time for you to do your own hair, you would know pretty much what I did. I try to be as detailed as possible. Okay. So, I'm going to do another one. And the 
purpose of me doing it small for the first time is to get the definition and then when I twist my hair again at night, I don't have to do it as small, the twist as small because I already have that definition. So I'm going to get the end really good, get the hair. I like to comb through it again to make sure those kinks is out. I think I need a trim. I don't know. I know I need a protein treatment again. I'm seeing some breakage. Okay. And then just get those ends, twirl it. And that's it. I'm going to do one in the front. Where did I have my part? Oh, let's make a new one. I'm just taking a little bit. Not in a lot. And you know what? Um, let me know some products you're using because I'm 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 in the market of getting. I know I'm gonna get like some more products from the QP line because I'm. I'm, I'm loving it. I'm so upset that I'm I'm not on with it. Okay, so I did that one. I'm going to do the rest of my head, and I'm going to come back, okay? Okay, so I have all my twists in. They're nicely moisturized. I am super, super impressed with this QP, this Elasta QP olive oil mango. I am super, super duper impressed because... My hair is dry, it's not damp, but it's just, it's giving my hair a nice sheen. Even though the thermal gives a sheen as well, it just looks so nice. It looks, I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. I love it. I'm so upset that I'm just now getting on this bandwagon because what I'm going to go do is, I want to try out the deep conditioner. I'm going to try out the conditioner. I may do the shampoo, but I'm going to get a few things from this line. I will be doing, I will, I'm going to be getting this stuff. I like it. And what I did was, um. I clipped my ends a little, like dust the twist, because they were kind of like straggly as I was twisting. My twists are not even at all, so I didn't want to really cut my hair. But I just wanted to have my twist so they could just twist kind of nice. So I just clipped the scissor just a little bit. So here is the twist. I hope this one does not shrink and this one doesn't shrink, because I want to have it kind of like, you know, in my face. We will see. So, I'm going to catch you guys back in the morning. I'm going to turban today. I'm going out. I want to do my hair early so it could be set for tomorrow. So, today is Saturday, and I'm going to head out. And that's it. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow on Sunday. Bye. Hey, ladies. So, we are back. Today is Sunday, and I'm going to be looking over here. I have a mirror back there so I can see what's going on. So, I'm going to take this off. My twists are pretty flat. This one did not shrink. I'm so happy. It feels nice and light. Nice and light. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some more of my oil. Because you know, through the course of the night and your scarf and everything, or your satin bonnet, it does suck up some of your, your oils. So I'm just going to start taking them out. I think this video... But well, this ending part will be kind of quick. I'm not going to have to cut it and take the twist out and then come back. But um, just like the ladies know, I do have a video coming up on this makeup look that I have on. In addition to, I have my video is up on why I took my twist out. So please check that out. I'm sure many of us, many of us 
can relate to why I took my twist out and things like that. And what else? Yeah, so that's about it. You know, I got a giveaway going on, ladies. It's like five more days, four more days. I know I think it's Thursday is the last day. So I'll be doing my little tallying up and entering my stuff from random.org and just picking from there. I must say I like the twists, how they're coming out. The definition, they're really, really soft. I was really, really surprised that it, it's feeling, I'm really surprised it's feeling this way. I was nervous. I was thinking last night, I was like, you know, I blow dry my hair, blow dry and dry your hair out. And my twist may be kind of dry, even though I put the moisturizer on it. So all the twists are out. It feels nice and airy. Oh my God. It feels like, to be honest, like I blow dry my hair and I had a, a hot comb put to my hair. <laughs> and the hot comb is like getting ready to wear out. Mm. So I'm just going to pull some apart. Pull them apart just in the top. It smells so good. Okay, so now I'm just going to take my pick. Now I'm going to twist my hair back up tonight because you know I've got to go to work in the morning and I'm going to want my hair to look just like this. I am feeling this, y'all. It feels so good. It don't feel like, you know, when, for you ladies who wash your hair and you twist your hair wet and then when you take it out, even though it may be soft or moisturized, it's still kind of like tight. Oh my God, I just don't feel like that. I'm loving the volume. Loving that. Okay. I'm looking in the camera. I'm looking in the viewfinder. I'm looking all over. But just so you know, you take your twist out. Just fluff it. Take your time. You know, if you rush, I mean, if you pressed in the morning and you ain't got time to be doing all of this, pick another style or figure it out but when you want your hair to have some value you got to play around with it and I am feeling this honey especially on this side I don't know what's looking like in the camera but this side looks like it's kind of getting where it needs to be I just got to focus on this side so what I'm going to do I'm going to keep on picking and I'm going to come right back I know I said I was, didn't think I was going to do that but I got to get over here and figure this out hey okay. ladies so this is it. I am feeling it. It is so nice, so fluffy. This is probably the biggest my hair has been since I have did my second big chop. I didn't want to put the um, hair kind of in my face. It would have went, like stop right here, but I kind of like it like this. So when I turn to the side, it can look like that and then vice versa. So I like it. This is the result of my dry twist out on using the Elastic QP. Um, ladies, if you have not tried it yet, try it. And if you do have it, try it on a dry twist out. I like this look because it's able to give me some length. It makes, you see, it kind of shows that I got progress going on here. So I love it. I'm going to go out for a few, hit the streets on a Sunday. I need to be in church, but it's not the story. But I'm going to go out a little bit <laughs> and enjoy this lovely day. I hope you guys are having a great Sunday. And I will see you in the next video. Don't forget, ladies, to please rate, comment, and subscribe. Check out my giveaway. In addition to like my video.